Let's talk supply chain. Trucking experts sending a grave warning that federal vaccine mandates could worsen the supply chain crisis before Christmas. Great. In a letter to the Biden administration, the American Trucking Association says a federal requirement for federal contractors to get the jab by next month will, quote, create a workforce crisis for our industry and the communities, families and businesses we serve. Join us right now to react is Sierra Nicole and Austin Carter, two truck industry veterans who are launching the Elite Trade Academy, Academy down in Texas. Good morning to both of you. Oh, good, good morning. morning. Sierra, let's start with you. Um, we just heard from Todd, number one issue to, for voters is the economy and jobs. Uh, regarding the economy, one of the problems right now is the supply chain issue. And part of it is, and we've got a graphic, we need more truck drivers. That's been a truck driver shortage for several years. Um, but this past year and a half, it's reaching almost crisis level. We are short about 80,000 drivers right now. Right. Over the next decade, uh, Carter, they say they're going to need a million drivers. And one of the reasons for that uh, is the fact that the current average age of a driver in the United States is 55. And they're thinking about retiring. Yes, that's true. Um, with a lot of drivers that are phasing out, there's not a lot of younger generation to fill the gap. So what we're trying to accomplish, we're trying to really highlight to get more of the younger generation and specifically more women into the industry. Yeah, uh, and that's key, Sierra. I can't tell you how many times I've been out on the highway and I'll look over and there's a woman driving. Uh, the reason I noticed that is because we had a, a segment about six months ago where a woman was in a driving academy and she said, you know, in the beginning I was kind of afraid because it's such a big truck, but after she took the training, she realized, you know, she can drive just like anybody else. And you have a, a, a situation where it's not just hands on, but do you start with a virtual trainer so you're not actually behind the wheel of an actual 18 wheeler in the beginning? Well, in the beginning, you'll actually be studying for your permit test um, for those first two weeks. And the second two weeks, you'll actually be in a real truck with a trainer, learning how to get comfortable with the truck and learning how to back and drive. And just to get comfortable, safety is our number one priority. Absolutely. And Austin, I understand that uh, there is a waiting list, uh, a wait list for people to get training because there are so many jobs available right now. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, with the waiting list, uh, like anything else, you can imagine with the uh, industry with the demand right now. So a lot of schools, including us, we have a large waiting list because we just can't service enough yeah. students in time. So with that being said, we need more drivers out there, but we also need to be we also need more schools with training to be sure. able to service. And, and Sierra, once somebody graduates, um, not only do you help them find a job, which is critical, if they want to set up a, a trucking business, you'll help them do that too, right? Yes, absolutely. Um, in 2021 alone, we have helped 4,000 uh, truck business owners start up their business. And, um, you know, being an owner operator has so many great benefits. So if there is a student who wants to go that route, we make sure that they have all the resources they need. And Sierra, exit question. How much can somebody make driving a truck these days? Yes, as a company driver, especially these days, companies are paying 20 to 30 percent more because of the demand. So you can make anywhere between 50 and 60 thousand your first year as a company driver, and over 100 thousand as an owner operator. That sounds fantastic. All right, and Austin, what's your website if people would like to get in contact with you? You can get get in contact uh, with us at elitetradeacademy.com. Very good. All right, uh, Sierra and Austin, we thank you very much for joining us today from Dallas, Texas. Thank you Thank for having you. us. All right, that's great.